We will guide you through the updated way to go and deactivate your Facebook account. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's jump into this. Facebook have recently gone and changed how their settings work. So I'm going to go and show you how you can go and deactivate your account. So firstly, what you need to do is head to your Facebook settings. If you're on a computer, go to the top right and tap on the your profile and then click on settings. And then to get your settings on a mobile device, you either need to go to the bottom right and tap on menu or go to the top right and tap on menu like this. Then scroll down to the bottom of this page until you see this section for settings and privacy expand it and then go and click on settings. Once you're in your settings, now what we need to do is go and open up the account center. So as you can see right at the top, we've got account center. So go and tap on it like this. Now you may go and see multiple accounts here. Don't worry. All you then need to do is scroll down into the account settings section. And what you then need to do is click on personal details like this. And once you're in personal details, you'll then see your contact info, date of birth, identity confirmation, and then account ownership and control. You need to go and click there. You've got two options here, memorialization or deactivation or deletion. So click there and then you can choose the account you want to do this to. In this case, it's Rob Robson. And then you can choose if you want to deactivate your account or delete it. So I've got deactivate selected. So I'll then tap continue. It'll then show you the pages and profiles which will then be included. If you're sure, tap continue. And you'll then need to go and enter uh, your password again. You'll then need to click on continue again and then you will need to go and give a reason. So I can go and put this as temporary, then I'll press continue again. Facebook then go and give you some alternatives and at the bottom you can choose when you want your account to be reactivated. For example, you could go and select don't do it automatically or maybe you want it done in seven days. So you choose your option, and then tap continue at the bottom. You will then need to go and confirm your decision. So make sure you read all of this and then at the bottom, you can then go and tap on deactivate my account. 